you're watching this video, you've probably just received your brand new Scuba Pro Matrix H computer. And what I want like to do today is just run you through how to set it up when you first take it out of the box. All right, so we're gonna take off this little scratch guard and we'll go forward from there. So first I wanna show you how these buttons work. This computer turns on by either pushing either one of these buttons down and holding it, or you just jump in the water and it turns on. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna go through the functions and have a look at the screen as we do that. So I'm gonna hit the right button, push and hold, and activate it. So now you can see that we've got date and time and the Scuba Pro name scrolling on the bottom. So we're gonna go through the functions, forward through the functions. This is the forward button, this is the back button. So here we go. Our first function is Bluetooth. We're gonna deal with that on another video. We're gonna go forward again, and you have your altitude. Again, compass, dive planner, logbook, and the time, and then the watch. So now we're back all the way at the home screen with the date and the time. So instead of going through all those functions to set up the watch, we're just gonna hit the back button from the home screen and we'll be right there. So to get into the watch, we're gonna push and hold the right button and get into it. There's an alarm, you can use this as an alarm, so we're gonna go ahead and set this alarm. And set it for two and then push and hold and set it. Push and hold and set. So here we go forward. We have our time zone. I've got it set right now for negative seven because that's where we're at in San Diego, California. So how you wanna change this though is to push and hold and it flashes and then you go ahead and set it for whatever time zone you're in. And when you get to your time zone, the enter button is also the set button. So now it's set for my time zone, okay? Moving forward, we've got the time of day, and right now I can see that it's in 24-hour clock, so I'm gonna advance one more time and go in and turn that off, because I like a 12-hour clock. So it's flashing, so I'm gonna hit the back button and go to on for a 12-hour clock, and go back, and now we'll set the time. And the time right now is two o'clock, so I'll push and hold, and we'll go to two, set, and then we'll set this to 201, and I've got the time set. So we'll go th forward, we'll pass this guy because we have it on 12 hour, and the date, and today's date is April 6th. So I'll push and hold this, the date will flash, I'll advance it to April, push and hold to set, and then the day is the 6th, push and hold to set, and it's 2017, so we'll push and hold to set that, and we're done with that. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and leave the sounds on, but uh, I think I should probably show you how to turn them off. So I'm gonna push and hold this, and advance it to off, and we'll go ahead and turn them off. And when you're making this computer silent, it wants you to give a code, just so you don't make it silent by accident. So the code on our computer is 313, so you're gonna advance to three, quick pushes, push and hold to set it, advance to one, push and hold to set again, and then advance to three. Oop, I went past it, so I go back, and push and hold to set. Now I've got no sounds on this computer. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and push and hold to activate the sounds back on. There we go, and I've got the sounds back on. And you don't have to put the code in to turn it back on because it's obviously making the computer safer. Um, so now we're at battery and you can see that there's six battery icons right there and, uh, and it's brand new so you're going to have all six. When you get down to two or three you would like you want to flip it over and change the battery yourself. You can undo this with a quarter out of your pocket and replace it with a 2450 battery. Okay and then we're going to go forward again. Wait, we're going to go back home and that's how you want to set it up. Um, I've got it set for the date and time. And if you have any questions about how to set up your new Matrix H computer, please go to scubapro.com and enjoy diving. Thank you.